All right. How's everyone doing? I got my bunny ears on. It's only appropriate for Easter. Um, we're gonna get started in about two minutes. All we need are some weights, gliders, or towels. Um, you can use small hand towels as gliders, weights, you can use cans, you can use um, wine bottles, maybe some champagne to make mimosas afterwards. It is Sunday after all, and it will be brunch time by the time we're done. Um, and yeah, maybe a chair or if you're standing up against the wall for balance. So we'll give it another minute or two and we'll get started. Can you hear the music? I think last time when I went to record a video, it kind of like cut the music on me because I didn't own rights to it, but that's okay. We'll go ahead and get started. I'm going to take these guys off because I know I won't make it throughout a whole entire class. Alright, so we're going to get started with our hand weights. So you want to go ahead, grab your hand weights, your cans, your wine bottles, whatever you're using, um, and I'll meet you guys on your map. Like you're lifting up a big 
bucket of water. We've got four. We've got three. Here's two. Last one. Excellent. Holding it right at the top. Your palms are going to open up towards the front of the room. You are going to lunge that back right leg down. Draw your knee up towards your chest. It's a back lunge. Arms swing back. Arms swing up with your knee. Bring it back. Lift forward. Bring it back. Lift. Going at your own pace. All your weight is shifted in towards your left leg. Keeping your core engaged. Excellent. Here's four. Three. Here's two. Last one. You're going to kick that left leg all the way back. Palms flip towards the ceiling. Pulse your arms up. Awesome job. Here's eight, seven, six. We're going to switch to that opposite leg. In three, two, one. You stand, palms face forward. Lunge it back. Drive that knee up. Lunge. Drive. You're lifting up that leg using your core while trying to maintain your balance. Perfect. We're here for four. We're here for three. Here's two. Last one. Hold that reverse lunge. Flip your palms towards the ceiling. Pulse. All your weight should be shifted in towards your front leg. Four, three, two, one. Go ahead, stand it up. You're going to come in through a nice wide stance here. All right, we're going to take it into lateral lunges. Your weights are right in towards your chest. We're going to take it to the left. Come back center. Reach for the right. Come back center. You're sitting your hips back. You're keeping your chest lifted. Sinking your hips towards that lateral movement. Excellent. We've got four more. Two more on each side. Last two. We're going to add a little hop here. So we take it to the left, to the right, to the left, to the right. It's like a little skater. Adding a little hop in the center. You've got it. Stay with it. Getting that heart rate up just a little bit. Really reaching for that opposite foot with your weight. Here's four. Here's three. Two more each side. Last one right here. Go ahead, hold that second position. Arms reach out into a wide V. Pulse them up. Your heart rate's up just a little bit right here. We're going to single one bicep curl with a releve. So we're going to curl right, left. You got it. Nice long spine here. Get one more inch lower. Breathe for four, three, everything at one. Let's go. Lift, lift, perfect. Four, three, two, just a bicep curl. Take it in, out. Squeeze from your core. Three, two, hold it out, pulse. Lower, lower. We're going to go back to those single arm curls. With a relevant, be nice and low. Here we go. Right, left, right, left. Feel those inner thighs firing up right here. Bring it all together. Take it lift, lift. Four, three, two, 
one. Go ahead, come right on up. Drop those weights close by. We're gonna come right back to them. You're gonna come right in through your plank. You want your shoulder and wrist to be in line. Modify. We're right here. Keeping your knees down, your toes lifted. But we're right here for now. Go ahead, rock it front to back. Amazing. Belly button in towards your spine. Hold it right here, that high plank. Your right toes are going to lift. You are going to come into a three-legged down dog. And then you're going to come back into your plank. Three-legged dog. Back in through your plank. Stay with it. Keeping that right hip down. You've got four. You've got three. Two more. Last one. Hold that down dog. Bend that right knee. Open up that hip. Go ahead. Step that right foot down. Bring that left arm across your mat. Open up into that side lunge. Option here. Drop that bottom leg for modification. That right arm swoops overhead. Right leg lifts. Elbow to knee. Crunch. Here we go. Take it in. Take it out. Take it in. Take it out. You've got to keep those hips lifted. Big exhale. Inhale. Here we go. Four more. Here's four. Three. Two. Last one. Go ahead. Come back and do that high plank. You're going to draw your knees right underneath your hips. Modified version is right here. You keep your knees down. Or tuck your toes. Hover your knees a couple inches above your mat. Squeeze it from your core. We're just going to bend slightly through the elbows. So it's a little press. Big extend. Press, extend. So always option to drop your knees all the way down. And really squeeze from your chest. Really squeeze from your triceps. We've got four. Three. Here's two. Last one. Hold. Four. Three. Two. Drop your knees out wide. Sit your hips back, child's pose. Rotate your wrists. We're coming right back up and through that plank. Go ahead. Find your high plank here. I'm going to switch sides just so I can face you the whole time. Finding that high plank or option to drop your knees down for that modification. Go ahead. Rock forward to back. Belly button in towards your spine. We got four, three, two. Hold it here. Left leg lifts. You lift up three like a dog. Come right back in through that plank. Three like a dog. Squeeze plank. Keep it going here. Awesome work. We've got four, three, two more, last one, hold that plank, drop that right forearm across the mat, opening up and through that side plank, option to drop that right knee down, bring that left arm across your head, and draw that knee towards your elbow, so modify this right here. You're squeezing from your oblique, holding it up. You've got it, stay with it. Keep your chest open. Really pressing that forearm in towards your mouth. Four more here. Three. Two. Last one. Come right back in through that high plank hold. Right here for eight. In four, in three, in two. Drop those knees. Round through your spine, drawing that ankle down towards your mat. Exhale, lift. Rounding through. Exhale, lift. One more time. In 
go ahead, take a seat back. We're gonna reach for those weights again. How are we feeling, good? All right, we're gonna take that right leg out towards the side. We're gonna really work through this left glute here. I want you to take your weight and bring it right in towards your chest. All we're gonna do, we're gonna squat back and lift up and squeeze. In three, two, here we go. Take it back. Lift up, squeeze. Take it back. So you're hinging at your hips. You're keeping your spine nice and long. Awesome. Squeeze from your core. Here's four. Three. And two. Last one. We're going to open up at the top. Bring it in center. Open up. Bring it center. Perfect. Keeping that right leg nice and long. We've got four. Three more. We're going to take it overhead. Here's two. Last one. Swing those arms behind you. Hinge at your hips. Lift up. Bring it center. And back. Overhead. And back. Keep those arms nice and long. Perfect. We're here for four. We're here for three. Here's two. Last one. Hold for eight, seven, six, five, and four. Three, two, one. Draw those knees together. Go ahead, sit back on your hips. You're going to take your elbows right in towards your torso, squeezing your knees together. You're going to press up, push, bring it back down. Press up, push, bring it back down. Big exhale, release. Squeezing those shoulder blades together as you draw those elbows back. Here's four, three, here's two. Hold those arms all the way up. Hold those hips up. Pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, and four, three, two. Bring those arms right in towards your chest. Right knee sees up. Left leg comes out nice and long. Hinging back. Bending at your hips. Lift back up. Squeeze and using that right glute to lift you back up. You want to really activate that muscle. Really feel that stretch along the inside of your left leg. We got four more. Three. Here's two. We're going to open up right here. Take it out. Bring it center. Bring it out. Center. Squeeze it from your core. Same thing on this side as we did on the opposite. We got three more. Here's two. Last one. Arms come all the way back. You hinge forward. Release those weights all the way up. Hinge. Bring it all the way up. You should feel that glute start to heat up here. Here's four. Here's three. Here's two. Last one, you're gonna hold those weights all the way by your side for eight, seven, six, five, and four, three, two, one. Drop your weights. Awesome job, go ahead, roll those shoulders out. Roll your shoulders forward. So great. All right, we're gonna get right into that chair work here. So if you want your chair, or you can use a wall for stability, go ahead, bring it right on over. How are we feeling, guys? All right, so we're gonna get right in through some thigh work and mix a little bit of glute work in there as well. We are going to start, you are going to bring the heel of your right foot in line with the arch of your left foot. So your hips are externally rotated out. You are going to plie down, and then you're going to 
elevate your heels up. So now we're in a staggered first position stance. I want you to just find a little pulse here. Excellent. So those knees are going out. You're lifting and squeezing with your inner thighs. Your spine is nice and long. Awesome. Pulse for two, then lift. Take it down two, lift. Down two, lift. So we can be a pulse, or you can just glide down for two and squeeze up. Whatever is comfortable for you. Your legs are gonna start to shake, it's okay. We've got four, three, here's two, Last one, hold nice and low pulse eight. Seven, six, five more, then we're gonna step that right foot out into second position. In three, two, one, here we go. Step second, up. So that right heel drops, but that left heel is staying lifted up and relevant. We're coming right back into that first position stagger. Amazing job, ladies and gentlemen, if you're out there. Here's four. Left quads burning up. In two. Hold it out. Right here and through that second pulse. Keep that left heel lifted. You've got it. For four, three, two. Hold it low. Releve up and down. Up, down, up. You've got it. Embrace that burn right here. Four, three, two, hold it up, right leg, lift, lower. We've got four, three, two, one, come back in through that first position, stagger, releve, pulse. You got an equal weight shifted into both legs now. In three, two, one. Woo! Amazing job. We're gonna switch right to that opposite side. All right, we'll stretch right after this. So, left heel in line with your right arch of the foot. Go ahead, plie down. Soft bend in those knees. Hover those heels up and find a pulse. It can be a high pulse, it can be tiny, or you can get nice and low. Opening up through the hips here. What else would you be doing on your Easter morning in quarantine, right? <laughs> for four, three, two. You go down for two, up for one. Take it down two, squeeze lift. Down two, squeeze lift. Soft bend in your knee as you come all the way up. I don't know if you can see my legs shaking from here, but they're out of control. <laughs> Nice heavy tailbone going down. We've got four. We've got three. Two. Last one, hold nice and low pulse. Seven, six, five. We're gonna step it out and through that second. Left heel drops, right heel stays releve, right here. Second position, lift. Second, lift. My right leg is shaking like a little leaf. Perfect. Amazing. Nice big step out. You're going to feel those hips open up. Four. Three. Two. Hold it out. Second pulse. Eight. Keep that right heel lifted. Keep that left heel grounded down. Four. Three. Two. One, hold it low, drop it, lift that right heel here. Take it down, take it up, down, take it up. Perfect, stay with it for four. Three more, we'll switch to that opposite leg. Last one, hold it up, take it up, lower. Switch to that left leg. Amazing job, we've got four, three, Woo, two, and one, hold it down, pulse, eight, seven, six, five, and four, three, step it back, staggered first, pulse, eight, 
seven, six. You've got it. Equal weight in each leg. In four, three, two, one. Drop it down. So good. All right. Go ahead. Take that left foot in towards your palms. Doing good on time. Excellent job. Go ahead. Step that left foot back. Nice high lunge right here. Taking that left arm up, reach across. Maybe grab some water here. Stepping left, center, switching into that right foot. And stepping it back into that high lunge. Bringing that right arm up and over. And coming back center. All right, we aren't going to need our chair here. So go ahead. If you have your chair, you can take it right out of the way. We're gonna get right in through some glutes mixed with some quad work. I am gonna show you the move and then you can follow along with me. We're gonna come in through that second position. Heels drawn in, toes are out. You are going to pulse for two. You're gonna take that right leg, Come in through that lunge, pulse for two. You're gonna step forward into a narrow squat. Take it down, down. So two times each, and then you open up second. So it's one, two, one, two. Narrow squat, narrow squat, back through second. All right, let's do it, here we go. One, two, one, two. Take it slow down, slow up. Take it down, take it up, back through second. Again, pulse, pulse. Two slow, narrow squats. Keeping those heels drawn down. Keeping your legs squeezed together. Down, down, perfect. You've got it. We have two more on this side. Last one right here. And now we're switching to that opposite side. So it's pulse for two, left leg for two, step narrow, narrow, pulse two, lunge two, narrow squat, narrow squat. Amazing, stay with it. Squeezing through your glutes. Squeezing through your core. You've got two more on this side. Last one. And hold it center. Hold. A little more inch lower. Four, three, two, one. Shake it out forward. Fold. So good. All right. We're going to take a seat here. I'm going to fold my mat. We're coming right into those gliders. Or if you have your towels, you're going to use your towels here. You're going to come right on towards your back. You get a sip of water real quick. Come right on towards your back. Step right on towards your gliders. Setting up for a bridge pose. Because your feet are on your towels or gliders, you're going to activate those hamstrings a little bit more to keep your feet nice and still rather than sliding from underneath you. It's a challenge, I promise. Keep those palms grounded down. All your weight is shifted in towards your heels. Belly button draws in. Here we go. Take it up, take it down. Up, down. You should feel those hamstrings ignite. Keeping those gliders right underneath your feet. Perfect. Eight more here. Here's eight. Squeezing your hips at the top. You don't have to get super high here to engage those glutes. You're doing a lot of work right here. In three, in two, hold it up. Let's pulse. Awesome. Tiny 
little pulses. All you gotta do is really engage your glutes. Squeeze them here, you got it. For four, three, two, pull those hips up. That left leg is gonna slide out and slide back in. In three, two, one, slide out, bring it in. Keep those hips lifted. Out, bring it in. If you don't have any towels or gliders with you right now, you can just tap your heel out and in. All your weight is shifted in towards your right glute. Perfect. For four, three, two, last one, hold it up. Pulse eight, seven, six, five, here's four, here's three, here's two. A little change, hold it up, that left leg lifts straight up. Pulse, here's eight, seven, no momentum in that left leg. Keep it nice and straight. For four, for three, for two, hold it up. That left heel comes to that right knee, lift it up to the knee, then lift, to the knee, then lift. Squeeze your core, squeeze that right glute, you've got it, for four, three, and two, last one, hold it there, press that left knee away from the body, single leg glute bridge, and here we go, you take it down, and lift, take it down, and lift, big exhale at the top, we've got four more, we've got three more, then we strip, switch, two, last one, pull those hips up, Bring that left foot right back on towards that glider. We're gonna do eight full bridges, then go into that right foot slide. Here we go. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Try to just hover your hips over the floor. Don't fully bring them down, just to hover. Last one, hold at the top pulse for eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, Hold it up, here we go, that right foot. Slide it out, bring it in. Slide it out, bring it in. Left glute is lifted all the way up. You're breathing nice and deep here. Perfect. Really using that hamstring to draw that right leg back in. You've got four. You've got three. Here's two. Last one, hold it here, right leg lifts, pulse for eight, four, three, two, one, right heel to that left knee, lift, Woo! left knee, right heel, for four, three, two, Last one, hold, press that right knee away from your body. Eight full bridges, you tap down, lift, or you hover. You got it. All that weight is shifted in towards that left heel. For four, three, two, last one, hold it up. Drop that right heel down on towards your glider. We're gonna alternate one right, one left, here we go. Take it right, take it left, take it right, take it left. All right, let's find this momentum here. And then we're gonna pick up the pace as if we're doing a bicycle in a bridge. We've got four, three, two, one. Here we go, right, left, right, left. Woo! You've got it. As one goes out, one draws back in. Squeeze from your core. Belly button in. Here we go for four, three, two. Hold those hips up nice and high. Pulse, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Drop those hips down. Hug those knees in towards your chest. Rock left to right. Ah, so good, amazing job. We're gonna reach for those weights. We're gonna keep our heels over those gliders. How we doing? 
We got four and then we're done. You're off for your Easter activities. One way each hand. Gliders under each foot. Arms are going to come out. Palms face forward. You're going to lean back. Weights are directly over your knees. All we're going to do, find a little pulse with those arms. Squeezing through the abs. Breathe. Inhale, exhale. We're going to come into Russian twist. When your arms come to the left side, your right foot extends. When your arms go to the right side, the opposite foot extends. I think you get it. Here we go. In four, three, two, one. Twist left, right foot. Left, right, left foot. Opposite foot, opposite side. Excellent. Squeeze through your core. You're leaning back the entire time. Squeezing from that belly button. Big exhales. We're here for four, three, two, last one, hold. Right in that center. Your legs are both going to extend and drop back in. Extend out, squeeze back in. Extend out, squeeze back in. Use that core. Perfect. Stay with it for four more. Three more. Here's two. Last one. Hold it all the way out. We're going to shift right to left. Weight's coming through the chest. Here we go. Take it left. Take it right. Big exhales. Legs are long here. Squeeze from your obliques. We're here for four. We're here for three. Last two. Last one. Hold it center. Drop those weights. Come right on towards your forearms. Bending through those knees. We don't need the gliders anymore. We're just going to lift those knees up. And we're going to extend those legs right to left. Here we go. Take it right. Take it left. Right. Left. Big breaths here. Squeezing through your core. Awesome work. We're here for four. We're here for three. Here's two. Last one each. We're going to extend both legs. Here we go. Push it out. Draw it in. Push out. Bring it in. Woo! Stay with it. You've got it. You are strong. Here's four more. Here's three more. Last two. Last one. Hold it out. Crisscross. Perfect. You've got it. We're going to take it up for two. Down for two. Here we go. One. Two. One. Two. Keep it up. You've got it. The lower you go, the more of a challenge it is. Here's four. Three. Two. Last one. Drop those heels down. Bring it all the way down. Find your crunch right here. Lift, lower. Lift, lower. You've got it. Squeeze that belly button in. Your whole entire spine is grounded through your mat. We've got four, three. Opposite hand reaches to opposite knee. Right here. Here we go. Squeeze right. Squeeze left. You've got it. We're going to draw that knee in towards our chest now. So it's a squeeze, draw in. Squeeze, draw in. Feel the obliques pinch. Perfect. You've got it. Here we go. Two more on each side. Then we're going to keep that cross, but we're going to lift those knees up to 90. Here we go. Cross. Cross. Squeeze from your core. You've got it. Here's four, three, two, one. Arms reach out. 
really lift those shoulders up, pulse. The legs extend. You got it for eight, seven, six, and four, three, two, one. Drop it down. Woo. Extend your legs nice and long. Really reach over your head. Full body stretch here. Nice deep breaths in. Exhale out. Go ahead, draw those soles of the feet together. Open up through your hips. This should feel good after all of those forward. Nice deep breaths here. Bring those knees together. Take that right heel over your left knee and reach for that left leg. Pressing that right knee away from your body. Drawing those shoulders down towards your mat. You're gonna keep your left foot grounded. You're gonna take that right foot, bring it all the way down towards the floor so that right knee is up towards the ceiling. Keeping that right shoulder planted in towards your mat. Maybe easing over. And go ahead, come back to center. And switch it up. Left heel over that right leg. And press that right leg in towards your body. Pressing that left knee away. Really feeling that hip open up. And same thing here, you drop your right foot down and you plant that left foot all the way down towards the floor. Keeping that left shoulder grounded in towards your mat, really pressing that left leg away from you, making sure the knee is up towards the ceiling. And coming back to center. Hugging both knees in towards your chest, drop them towards the right, small little circles. Maybe rotating those ankles too. And switch it up. Left side. Holding it center. Go ahead, drop yourself up. Coming into all fours. We'll stretch those shoulders out a bit. Taking that left arm, thread it through the right, drop your shoulder. Keep your hips lifted here. Feeling a nice spinal twist. Opening up through the shoulder blades. And coming all the way up. Right arm reaches, extends through the left, dropping your shoulder. Coming back to center. Sitting all the way up. Take a nice deep breath all the way up. Exhale your hands in towards your heart. Thank you guys for showing up. Thank you so much. Happy Easter. I hope you enjoy the day with your family. I am posting out a uh, we can advance schedule. Um, I will post that a little bit later, but I'm going to do some heavy weights. I'm going to do some resistance band work, um, a lot of hit work, and a bunch of fun stuff like that. A few bar classes here and there. Um, so yeah, enjoy your Easter. Love you guys. See ya.